It is no secret that my view on women's rights, on gay rights, on contraception is different than the church's. But I think in this world, what we have to do is work with people when we can work with them. And his leadership in terms of the need to create a moral economy, uh, the need to make sure that we transform our energy system <laughs> so as to prevent climate change from wrecking havoc on this planet has been extraordinary. So you work with people in those areas you can, where you disagree, everybody knows what the disagreements are, and let's work together where we can. And uh, certainly in the reporting leading up to the conference yesterday, there was an indication that there's an element within the Vatican that has felt the burn, so to speak. <laughs> that may be the case. That I, I, if so, I am honored and pleased by that, because the truth is, uh, I think it is fair to say there have been few members of the Senate, if any, uh, who have been more outspoken in support of the role that the Pope is playing uh, in the fight for not only economic justice, but talking about the need to create a moral economy. What we have now, where so few have so much and so many have so little, in my view, is not only immoral, it is unsustainable. And certainly in terms of climate change, if we don't boldly address this crisis, I worry very much about the kind of planet we'll be leaving our kids and our grandchildren. Now, why do you suppose the other people running in this election, in, the, in this lead up to the election, none of them were invited? Hillary Clinton, Ted Cruz, uh, Donald Trump. Uh, you'll have to ask them and you'll have to ask the Vatican. And uh, now there has been some talk that you sort of abandoned the campaign trail to come over here uh, to Rome. How do you respond to that criticism? If anyone has been following me in New York State for the last week to talk about abandoning anything, I, we were doing rally after rally after rally. We had uh, 27,000 people out of Washington Square Park. We're going back to do another rally, I think, tonight. We're going to be working very hard for the next few days. Uh, we'll have talked to over 100,000 people in upstate New York, uh, in almost every borough in the city of New York, uh, New York. We have been working very, very hard. But I did feel that getting this invitation from the Vatican, uh, given my enormous respect for the Pope, is something that I just could not refuse.